at the Tron Uprising Junket Premiere Party. This is the first time that we, the whole cast has been assembled. The cast is just incredible. And, and it's really <laughs> <laughs> Except for that guy. We haven't actually seen them all together since I think the kickoff. I mean, that was like two years ago. It was so incredibly cinematic and far beyond what I would imagine ever seeing as an animated television show. To me, I'd never really seen an animation quite like that before. It was beautiful. It looked like framed pieces of art. It feels like it's ahead of its time, as far as animation goes. The reaction's been incredible. Like, everyone is, like, super excited. People are, are coming up to me like, I'm, I'm actually going to watch this show, like all of them. I, I really want to see this show. It's cool. It is Bruce's birthday. They, they, uh, they surprised me. They did. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Bruce just cut his birthday cake, and there was a vehicle on it, the ATV, and he cut right through the tire. I, I was the only guy screaming, not through the tire! It was a big team effort. There were so many people behind it, and there were people who did a few characters, then went on to design a few vehicles. There's there's a beautiful blend of, of design language there. The artists that worked on this have managed to put more creativity in every image in this thing than I thought was even possible. It looks amazing. It's next level. It's written pretty much for any audience. It's not. It's safe for kids, but I clearly there are some adult themes in it. It was exciting to be working on something that kind of pushed the boundaries of what we're familiar with. It's like being able to tap into the recesses of your imagination and being a kid all over again.